Good evening, watchers. Welcome, welcome back to the channel and to another review from us. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, this time we're going to go ahead and talk about The Upside, which is actually an American adaption of The Untouchables, which is a French movie. Yep. Not The Untouchables, but The Intouchables. Oh. Yeah, I know. That would have that would, that been great if we got an Untouchables. No, I, no, no, I probably leave wouldn't. It, alone. it really leave probably it alone. would. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, this one stars Brian Cranston, Kevin Hart, and Nicole Kidman. And. Yep. Yeah, as, no, as our normal review. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh, Jesus. I was jumping in. You, right you are so excited right now. Hold Go on. ahead and give the people what they want. Tell them All what right. the movie's about. So this movie is, Philip is a wealthy quadriplegic who needs a caretaker to help him with his day-to-day -day routine in his New York penthouse. Love a New York penthouse. That'd be great. Uh, I would not, just because of the money. That's true. But he's super rich. Uh, so he decides to hire Dell, a struggling parolee, who's trying to reconnect with his ex and his young son. Despite coming from two different worlds, an unlikely friendship starts to blossom as Dell and Philip rediscover the joy of living life to the fullest. Get you right here, doesn't it? So good. So, Go. it's called sarcasm, okay? Don't give me that look. Go ahead, buddy. <laughs> Tell him what you liked. Okay. I absolutely love Brian Cranston and just about everything he's in. Uh, not Power Rangers, of course, because that sucks. <laughs> you know, if he if he heard you say that, he would be upset at you because that's like one of his babies. That's true. That's true. Okay, I'll be honest. I do like Power Rangers a little bit. I'll be honest. I'm sorry, buddy. It's just a bug him. Uh, yeah. So I like Brian Cranston just about everything, including this. He's a great actor. He's fantastic and. Pretty much anything he puts his mind to, from yeah, pretty much. <laughs> from the beginning days of Power Rangers, yep, and Malcolm in the Middle, yep, to the stuff like this and Breaking Bad, he's he goes all in. It's fantastic. Um, Kevin Hart did actually really good yeah. in this movie, like a lot better than I expected. Like he's kind of kind of branching out a little bit because he's just, while he still does the comedic role of this movie, he, it's it's a lot darker, which we'll touch on much later. Yep. Uh, but yeah, he did. They both did great. Yep. And yeah, that's it. Those are, those are my positives. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and ditto everything Matt just said. And then I'm going to go into mine. Is that mine are, there are some funny parts to this movie. Now, they go ahead and give you a trailer to make you believe it. It is a straight comedy, but we'll get to that later. Also, the, would like to touch on one quick little thing is that the catheter scene, that's all I'm going to say. Yeah, it's fantastic. Freaking hilarious. It's the funniest part That's of the movie. That's easily the funniest part of the movie. Uh, yeah, the, and there's there's kind of more than one when it yeah. comes to oh, that, yeah, the, that scene. There's a trailer one, and then there's the movie version. Yeah. And, oh boy. Yeah, it's it's, oh boy. it's the best part. Yeah. Um, yeah, I guess that's really it. We 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 like a lot of the same stuff, so yep. it keeps so it easy. easy. So it's simple and easy. Yeah. So, Zach, what are your negatives for the movie? Oh, man, my negatives. Yeah. Oh boy. Um, you know, I will, I feel like you should talk about the one thing before I jump into that. Just should I? Because, I mean, I feel uh, like you should because then it kind of follows what okay, you say okay. with it. We'll go for it. All right. Uh, yeah. So I guess I'm starting the negatives this time around. Uh, my biggest negative is it's really a dark movie. Like I was expecting to walk into a comedy and it's got a little bit of funny. Like they're like, I was chuckling throughout the movie. Yeah. But it's not as funny as I was expecting to see. Yeah. Like, it's definitely a much darker tale. Um, so, first off, whoever's doing the marketing in Hollywood right now, you need to you need to watch the movie first, I guess. <laughs> Cause... Like, learn how to properly... Or just... Have, yeah. yeah. As a trailer. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it was just, it's just really weird marketing for this movie when I was... I was expecting to laugh a lot through this movie, and I really didn't because I was More, trying to... It's... It's drama. a drama. It's 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 a drama. I wouldn't yeah. I wouldn't call it even a comedy. I yeah. would say it's a it's a drama. Yeah. Uh, and other than that, it really brings nothing new to this style of story. Yeah. Because like for beat for beat, it follows the based on a true story like plot line. Yeah. It, it sticks to the same exact points where oh guy guy struggling to do something gets luck of the draw and he gets this amazing thing to happen to him and then he does something to mess it up and then redeems himself again blah 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 it fall it, it's every story yeah. like that is yeah. the exact same so it's a big negative for me all right so my negatives really quick are that the jokes shoehorned in not really that funny 
at times they're just like all over the place. And then one of the bigger, th biggest parts of the movie is that you're supposed to believe Brian Cranston and Kevin Hart together as a team. It just didn't match up to me. And no. when no. they did match up, it was too little, too late into yeah. the movie. So for me, they're not bad actors. They just, you know, it's like. They didn't get enough time to build that chemistry. Yeah, it just... And the movie's two and a half, almost two and a half hours long. Two hours and six minutes. I think it's just well, over two hours. Well, with trailers. Yeah, that doesn't matter. I'm just saying. <laughs> but anyway, it's an okay movie. Yeah. And they definitely gave you a different feel of what they were telling you in the trailers. Yeah. So, I think we're about the same with our scores, so let's just get it over with. I gave it a 50-50. I also gave it a 50-50. Yeah, so it's not a great movie, it's not a bad movie. It's just a... Give it a shot if you want to, but it's it's really up to you. Yeah. Um, it, But just don't go in expecting a huge comedy hit. It's a much darker drama movie, and yeah, yeah. That's, that's about it. So Thank you guys, as yeah. always, for watching. We love you. Yeah, we and definitely love you. We'll see you on the next one. Yeah. Love you guys. Bye. Not gonna say happy.